Nolagent here at Marie's Bar and Kitchen. Good stuff in here, yeah. Welcome to Nolagent. Let the good times roll. In this episode of our New Orleans Travel Vlog, we are in the New Orleans Bywater neighborhood at Marie's Bar and Kitchen for the original Slap Burger on a travel search for the best burger options in New Orleans. Marie's Bar and Kitchen is located at 2483 Burgundy Street, right at the intersection of Burgundy and St. Rock Streets, which is about six minutes and one mile away from the New Orleans French Quarter. This is a great example of a neighborhood bar, which is still a common thing in the New Orleans area, but not as common as it used to be. So I have visited Marie's Bar and Kitchen many times in the past and eaten some of the food from some of the other kitchens that have been operating out of Marie's Bar. So the current restaurant that's operating out of Marie's Bar and Kitchen is the original Slap Burger. And I have had multiple viewers of the Nolajet channel Highly recommend that I come out here and sample the Slap Burger here. So let's go ahead and head on inside here and check this place out. So the bar area is right here in the front. They also have a pool table, some video poker, and other entertainment options in addition to the bar here in the front area. So you can certainly pass a good time with a lot of adult entertainment in this area. And then we're going to head on back to the kitchen area where the Slap Burger accepts cards, the kitchen and bathrooms are in the back, but the bar is cash only. So you can use a credit card to get your food, but not to get your adult beverages. So we'll be going through this long, narrow hallway here, and then we get to see the order counter. So this is where the magic happens. So, I have a lot of uh, high expectations for this place. They have a lot of pictures of people that have enjoyed their Slap Burger right here. And we'll see if uh, the Slap Burger can meet the expectations. So let's go ahead and check out their menu now. So we have the OG, $10. A quarter pound all beef patty with slap sauce, pickles, American cheese, grilled onions on toasted brioche. Double patty, 14. Vegan, 15 or 19. The heater, $10. A quarter pound all beef patty with heat sauce, jalapenos, American cheese, grilled onions on toasted brioche. Double patty, 14. Vegan, 15, 19. The large mac, 15. Two quarter pound all beef patties with mac sauce, lettuce, pickles, American cheese, onions on toasted brioche. Single patty, 10. Vegan, 15 or 19. Other stuff and things. The quad, 23. Grilled cheese, dressed like the OG, $7. Chicken tendies, $9. Mozzarella sticks, $7. Fries, side of fries, $3. Basket of fries, $6. One basket equal two sides. Dessert, flan. Slice, Cuban style, vanilla custard with caramel drizzle, $5. Featuring flan from the only flans by Chef Eli. Then we have the original Slap Burger Hours. Kitchen accepts most forms of payment Monday, 5 p.m. to 10 p.m., Tuesday, 5 p.m. to 10 p.m., Wednesday, 5 p.m. to 10 p.m., Thursday, noon to 10 p.m., Friday, noon to 12 a.m., Saturday, noon to 12 a.m., Sunday, noon to 9 p.m. So I put my order in and then you pay. So I got the original Slap Burger OG and a side of French fries and the total with tip was sixteen dollars and twenty four cents so here's my slap burger and fries and they also give you a fortune cookie on the side which is kind of a cool little way to uh end your meal for dessert now on inspection of this burger it looks nice but i think i should have gotten the double burger it just looks like there is some uh, potential for juicy beefy goodness here but the uh, single patty is uh, okay, where I think a double patty would make this a far better burger. So, don't make my mistake. If you make a visit here, get the double instead of the single, as I think it would just make for a much better burger. Now, uh, there's not any uh, overwhelming dripping juiciness of flavors coming out everywhere. It's uh, certainly a more thoroughly cooked burger. Uh, you're not going to be able to get any kind of medium cooked burger here. You're pretty much getting it the way they cook it here and no other way. So there's a little bit of crunchiness to the meat, the way a lot of smash burgers have uh, their cooking format, the way they do the style of that. So this has gone down pretty quick and easily. And here we are with the last bite. So, uh, the smash burgers on average aren't my favorite kind of burger. Some I've enjoyed. This one, that uh, was okay. 
All right, the French fries, good salt content, nice and salty, so good flavors here. They did not hold back on the salt shaker, thankfully. So these are uh, very nice French fries and uh, exactly the way they should be. So here we go with the last fry. So that whole meal went down pretty quickly and easily. So just like until they destroy this burger and fries, go ahead and destroy that subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up. Comment below. Let me know what you thought about Marie's Smash Burger and the fries. And while you're down there, make sure to check out the link to my Patreon account as I do work for tips and I appreciate any help with that. And also, if you check out the description under this video and see all the links to Amazon for the cookbooks, you can check those out. And even if you don't buy a cookbook and you buy something else, also get a little bit of a commission off that, which also greatly helps. So, thanks so much to everybody at Marie's Bar and Kitchen and to the original Slap Burger. I did enjoy my burger. I just think a double probably would have given me a better experience overall. So, we'll have to go back and try the double Marie Smash Burger. Overall, generally, the Smash Burgers aren't my favorite variety of burger. They're, you know, all right for what they are. I just usually find them a little overcooked and too crunchy, crispy on the outside. Uh, the original Smash Burger here was not too overly cooked and too crunchy, crispy on the outside. Still a little more, uh, less meaty, juicy deliciousness than I prefer and more of those thicker burgers like we often have in New Orleans. But hey, if you love Smash Burgers, you definitely would probably enjoy the experience here. Then definitely, thanks so much to all of you out there for tuning into the Nolagent channel, especially to my Patreons. And now, if you would so kindly, go ahead and share this video with any of your friends or contacts that would enjoy it. It really would help me with that YouTube algorithm. And then, tune in next time for more good food, good times, and good people. Nolagent here, and thanks so much for watching. And just go ahead and destroy this video right here to keep up with the fun.